Welcome to the Spiritual Transformation Series podcast with your host, author, and pastor, Dennis Lee of Living Waters Fellowship Church, located in Mesquite, Nevada. Good morning. Today's podcast is entitled Living by Faith. Sometimes there are just some things that we're never going to know. This is something we need to settle in our hearts early on if we ever want to move forward in the fullness of what God has for our lives. The Bible says that by faith, Abraham left his home and country and traveled to a land he had little or no idea about. In other words, by faith, Abraham moved without rhyme or reason. The writer of Hebrews chapter 11, verse 8 says, By faith, Abraham obeyed when he was called to go out to a place which he would receive as an inheritance. And he went out, not knowing where he was going. By faith, we believe in the existence of God, even though we cannot see or comprehend him with our natural senses. And for having this kind of faith, God will richly reward us, as the writer of Hebrews said a couple of verses earlier. He said, he who comes to God must believe that he is and that he is a rewarder of those who diligently seek him. Abraham lived by faith, which is defined in Hebrews 11.1 1, as being the substance of what we hope for and the evidence of the things we do not see. The Apostle Paul, in his letter to the Roman church, made this observation when it comes to Abraham's faith and the reward that came from that faith. It's found in Romans chapter 4, verse 18. He said, Against all hope, Abraham in hope believed and so became the father of many nations. Just as it has been said to him, so shall your offspring be. But humanity today has a hard time wrapping their head around this reality, even though they live by faith as well. Their faith, however, is in natural sciences, which still has yet to explain humanity and the universe. But a Christian's faith is based upon God, and even while we cannot see him, we know he exists by the world and universe that he created. Yes, science has done much in helping us with our everyday lives, like medicine and much of our modern-day technology, but has done precious little in explaining the mysteries of the universe, which has produced a generation of mindless spiritual zombies instead of faith-filled spiritual giants. In 1 Corinthians 5-7, the Apostle Paul said, For we walk by faith, not by sight. And so may the Lord bless you and keep you in his grace today. Take care and may God bless. Repentance is a purposeful change of direction. It's a sincere commitment on our part to forsake our sins and purposely walk in obedience with God's word. Pastor Dennis Lee expounds on this concept in his book, Wells of Living Water. For further information, go to spiritualtransformationseries.com. Pastor Dennis Lee is the senior pastor of Living Waters Fellowship in Mesquite, Nevada, and has been called a practical theologian, making doctrine simple to understand and easy to apply. His 333 devotionals are where biblical doctrine and discipleship meet to encourage and inspire the reader to make a difference for Christ in the world around them. These daily devotionals, along with thoughts, tweets, and sermons, can be found on Living Waters Fellowship page, www.mesquitelivingwaters.com.